Hey everyone, I'm Wilsonator and welcome back to Project Zomboid. Yes, I'm back for this game, finally. Um, so it's actually been a very long time since I uh, last did a recording of this game. Uh, the reason for that, uh, which I'm very sorry for, is it's all down to the fact that like the game just felt too easy for me, really. Um, I'll be honest, it did feel pretty damn easy. Like I, I wasn't dying, I, I wasn't really in any trouble. So we're actually going to play it a bit differently this time. I'm playing on sandbox mode, and we're going to set make the settings a bit hot. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, we're going to make the settings a bit harder for us. Uh, so we're going to start off by creating a new world, a whole new world. Uh, we're going to go into West Point because that's like the best place. Uh, so I've actually got this preset, the Walking Dead. Um, so this is uh, uh, it's all set up. Yeah. Uh, so this is like it just makes it a lot harder. Um, uh, let's actually put the locked house's frequency up a bit. I could change the uh, house alarms, but nah, we're not going to do that. There's no zombie respawn, no loot respawn either. Um, so we're going to have to be moving around a lot. Uh, so zombies have long memory. Um, that's pretty much it. They That means they'll follow you for a lot longer, I guess. Um, now the loot rarity is extremely rare. Um, this means we're going to have to search a lot more for different types of loot and there's also a lot more zombies we've got a higher zombie count so it's gonna make it a bit harder so let's uh let's make a guy uh let's make like joe joe stanley i, I guess i don't know joe stanley and uh he's gonna have red hair he's he's a ginger not not that i have anything against gingers i actually have a ginger cousin um and he's got goatee he's, he's one of these uh these great guys. Um, what other things? Let's say, should he be a park ranger? Or should he be... Hmm. We don't want to make it easy for ourselves by giving us thick skins. We want to make it, like, deadly. Uh, let's give... A, let's Yeah, let's be a park ranger, actually. Or should we be a security guard? Yeah, because that means we don't have to sleep as much. Which is kind of a good thing. Because no one likes watching me sleep. Well, I don't know. Uh, so, first thing to make it a bit harder, we're going to give him a hearty appetite. So, he needs to eat a lot more. Um, we're going give, to give him strong, graceful, athletic. Those are like the standard ones. Um, we can give him brooding, light drinker, short tempered, claustrophobic, cowardly, agoraphobic. These ones don't matter. I think I mentioned this before. Um, they You get panicked anyway, no matter what, so it's kind of pointless not having them. Even if you have brave, your character still gets like extreme panic all the time, so it's just really pointless otherwise. Um, we're going to make him resilient. That will make it, like, uh, because there's actually a, a new medical system that's been added in this build. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll take a look at that as well, uh, I guess. Uh, hopefully not, actually. Hopefully we don't get injured. So you have to take a lot more precautions. Um, should we, I'm just wondering, should we keep the music on or off? Because it, it does kind of distract me when I'm recording and I've got music. Uh, I don't think I could turn it off in the screen anyway. Um... So if if you guys are kind of new to this channel and you don't know what this game is, uh, I should have really explained that a bit earlier. But yeah, it's just a great old zombie survival game. I really like it. It's a fun game. Um, so there's actually all the new skills that's been added as well. Uh, there's tons of new stuff. So we've got this new body screen and you can actually treat things differently. And things like smashing windows and climbing through them, you can cut yourself now. So that makes uh, like a lot more danger in that sense. What do we actually have in this house? We've got a frying pan. Let's use that as a like a starter weapon I guess. Um, we've got some tuna. I'm actually going to turn off the music. I might add... Mm, should I? I don't know. Can I turn it down a little bit? Uh, music volume down to like 3 I guess. I might turn it up again for the video. It's just like when I'm recording it it's a little bit louder than it will probably be in the video. Uh, so we don't have a lot in this house actually. Do we have any any bedroom here? Um, oh, we've got a, a doll. Um, what, what have we got outside? Any zombies? Yeah, we've got some zombies over there. Um, what else have we got? Uh, we've got a spoon. I suppose we could we could do them with a spoon. A plastic bag, which seems to have a plastic bag inside of it. Okay. Should we take that as our primary container for now. Does it actually have a plastic? Yeah, it does. Look at that. Oh, I guess that's true, actually. You do that, usually. 
if you're storing all your plastic bags, you usually put them inside each other. So we're going to put all our food and stuff in there for now. Um, we're not going to stay in this house because this place is tiny. Um, I can't wait until they add the TVs because they're, they're actually adding TV channels, um, like news channels and stuff for the start of the apocalypse. Uh, so that'll be really fun. Ooh. Some, oh look, my guy's starting to get really hot. Yeah, that's the problem. I need to get a vest or something. Sweat is too much. We're gonna we're gonna just go, like we're gonna go shirtless for now. God, he, he doesn't really look ginger anymore, does he? He looks more ginger in the character screen. Um, let's let's, let's take out this guy. Let's, let's fuck him up. Oh crap! That guy's been alerted. The frying pan is not the best choice of weapons, but it's not bad. I could do worse. I could use a spoon. Although that would be hilarious. Oh look, it's open. Uh, actually, should we should we grab this guy's uh, vest? Sorry, zombie. I just need a pink vest. Yeah, that's better. Good. Look at check that out. Check this guy out. Okay, there's no one in here. So, firstly, I just want to get like a, a decent. Uh, I've got some alcohol, I guess. Uh, let's take it. Screw it. My guy will be happy happy for it later on, I guess, if he gets really thirsty and he, he needs needs to, to get a drink. We need a can opener. That's essential for opening cans. Uh, clearly. What else have we got in here? No one? No zombies? We've got some sheets. Actually, let's, let's prepare in advance. Let's rip these up. So that we've got some sort of standard bandages to use. Um... In case of an emergency, rather than ripping up our shirt on the spot, we've got some in our bag ready to go. Oh look, he's starting to get hot again. Fuck it, we'll take off the shirt. Is it? Yeah, I guess it is in the middle of July. Um, time up there. Um, oh, actually, I only missed up this place. This might have a hammer in here or something. I hate the heartbeat sound effect. I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's really scary. It's quite cool. It seems to actually like follow as if you're you're following your character's uh, heartbeat, like when you're opening closets and stuff, and you're like, "Oh crap, is there a zombie in here?" I don't know. Oh uh, god, I know where I am. I'm at the estate area. This is quite the area. Let's actually close off a uh, close off the health area, um, the health panel. Sorry, because we don't need that open unless we get injured, like now. Probably. Oh crap. I could take out three, surely. Oh, did I kill that one already? Or did it... Oh, no, I didn't. There you go. Okay, they're all dead. Yeah, three's no problem for us. Um, it's when you get into the... Like, the big groups of them where we've got to be really careful. Anyone? Oh, crap. Okay. These houses are usually unlocked, I find. These ones usually never have um, locked doors. Oh, okay. It has a locked door. My bad. Might have an alarm as well that goes off. That would not be good, to be honest. Let's actually just check the uh, garage over here first for like maybe some hammers or or anything. And there's zombies in here. No. Okay. Um. Yeah, I did. I did do some sort of gameplay with the um, like without recording. Um, where I was playing with the medical system. It's pretty cool. You have to properly disinfect your wounds and everything, and you know, otherwise you're gonna die. Like I, I, I had so many wounds, and I, I was pretty sure I was gonna die, but I actually pulled through in the end. It was really good. No one's chasing us. Check for an alarm. Cool, no alarm. This, that usually means that there's a zombie in here somewhere. I, one thing I've noticed is a bug is this loot screen doesn't go away. You have to keep closing it, which I don't like because it's just pissing me off. Like the other ones close when you just click away from them. It's pretty annoying. Oh, we got a banana. Uh, actually, let's eat that now, shall we? Yeah, look, we're getting hungry. Might as well. There we go. And we're also getting thirsty. We should probably drink. They've added some sound effects as well, I noticed. Anything in here? No. What about in here? Any zombies? 
Got a razor, toothpaste. No, that's just crap. It's junk, junk items. Uh, did we check in this closet? No, we didn't. Nothing. See, this is what I mean. Extremely rare loot. Like, usually I would have, like, gone into this house and I probably would have found everything I would need to last me, like, two months. You know, it's, it was pretty, it's pretty ridiculous when you're in normal loot settings. It's as if no one packed up and, and evacuated. They just literally all just died. But you'd imagine in, in a real zombie apocalypse, they would have took all th that stuff. Well, most of it anyway. You know, except for the ones who died really early. Yeah? Thought I heard a, a zombie. I don't know. I have to be careful. Is there a zombie in the house with me? Probably. It's probably in one of the other rooms. No, not in here. There's some ah, uh, these are medical supplies, these cotton balls. What in here? No? Zombie? Okay, I think we're okay for now. Um in fact, pr we'll probably start to uh how many sheets are there? There's one. Uh, I suppose that would be good. We could um, secure up like one of these rooms. Uh, this bedroom over here. Yeah. Oh, it's already got curtains anyway. I can put the sheet back then. I don't need it. It, it takes up too much weight. And we can use this as a, a place to sleep tonight, I think. Oh, God. No zombies out here? Okay, there is quite quite a few zombies over there. Um, don't know if about getting to that house without being seen. How am I unpleasantly hot? Do you want me to strip down to my boxer shorts? God. Oh, what do we level up? Ah, oh, sneaking. Oh yeah, I think I actually, uh, I think I may have actually had that on in the sandbox settings. I think my levels increase faster than usual. Sorry about that. But no, I guess in a way it's kind of cool because it saves watching loads of tedious grinding to increase my levels. We just sort of increase... Oh, fuck. That guy's seen me. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. We don't... I don't want to draw too much attention to me. If they could just walk past it, past me, that would be great. Okay, let's go in this and hide in here for for a second. Let me take these guys out. Anyone else? No. Okay. It looks like the that house is completely overrun. No, 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 no. Stay away from my house. Anyone on this window over here? Yeah, there is. Come on. I don't want them to break into my house. Come on. Die. Cool. Oh, look, I leveled up again. We're gonna level up this time. Ah. Blunt weapon. Accuracy. Yeah, that'd be cool. Don't really know what that does, but okay, we all safe. We've got no zombies broken in. Damn. Yeah, there's definitely no loot in that house now. Okay, I guess we we we'll need to see. Uh, that at least would have drawn them away from other places, wouldn't it? Like from this house here. So this house should be fairly clear. How am I unpleasantly hot? Guys walking around shirtless. I guess there's not much you could. Oh my. Okay, I guess those guys wanted to, to desperately get to the other house, so they were just bundled up against the door. Is that one dead? Yeah, wow. One hit. Anyone else in here? Trying to get out? No? Uh, someone did get out of that window there. Uh, it's another frying pan, another can opener, but no, no food. There's some lettuce. Meh. I don't have a f fine. We'll eat this. Yeah. Oh look, there is another guy in here. Okay, don't worry about him.
Ja, ah, så är det för mig nu. Kör det så. Ho! No one. Anything here? No. What I want is some sort of, uh, like a baseball bat or an axe. Those are my, like, ideal weapons, um, of choice. Oh, some, some ammo, which we, we actually have a gun, but we could have some ammo, I guess. Let's just hope we're not getting chased by like a million fucking zombies. Oh, no one's chasing us. Okay. Cool. What's in there? Nothing? Can I not loot that one? Oh, I can. It's just a bath towel. No? No zombies. Clear. So, uh, I think I'm gonna, I think I know where I'm gonna settle down. Um, I've got a, a, an idea of, like an I idea of where I wanna, um, set up camp. Uh, I'll let this guy's jump back in to join the party. There you go. Oh. You can tell when they're not dead if they sort of stagger back. Uh, if they just fall down then they're dead. But if they, if they stagger back then they're sort of going. Uh, so you just hit them again. Like double tap. Actually, let's, uh, Let's jump back into this house over here for for a nice old sleep, because uh, we're gonna have a big day tomorrow. We're gonna travel down into like central midpoint, and that's where we're gonna um, west point. Even it, it's not midpoint, um, central west point, and we're gonna like cause all sorts of men down there. Start setting up a proper base. Uh, are we in this room, yeah. Cool. Let's uh, let's sleep for seven hours. Sounds good to me. Oh shit, was that my building? Let's just hope they don't, uh... rudely awaken me with, uh... I think that might be my building. It's very dark as well, we're gonna have to skip some time. Okay. Okay, well, my guy's getting slightly hungry. We don't really have much food. We've got some tuna. We don't need to eat right now, I guess. We can just go a bit hungry for now. Ah, oh, shit. There's probably going to be some guys down here. No. Uh, that doesn't look broken to me. Okay. Uh, I'm going to actually uh, end the episode here. Um, because it's getting quite quite long into the thing. Uh, but I'm going to carry on recording from this point and start the second episode now. Uh, so, yeah. Thank you for watching, guys. And I will see you next time.